Hey, what's going on, everyone? And welcome back to another episode of Just My Opinion. Guys, this is my initial reaction for the latest Christopher Nolan film, Oppenheimer. Man, I was really looking forward to this. I love Christopher Nolan. I love all of his films. He's one of the best in the game right now. And he's also the grandmaster of IMAX. He shoots a lot of his films with those IMAX cameras. I think the only person that can compete with him there is Michael Bay with the Transformers films. Not talking about the quality of the actual movie story, but just the IMAX. But yes, that's one of the things that I was really looking forward to. But seeing this, and plus it has such a great cast. Unfortunately, the screening that I went to was not able to present this to me in IMAX. And so I saw it on just a regular theater and it, it was still good. It was still entertaining for what I remember. And the reason I say that, guys, is first of all, the performances across the board were fantastic. And I really did love seeing all of these genius minds coming together, trying to break through science technology to a point with quantum mechanics that we've never seen before. And the score by Ludwig Gorison was fantastic too. He did some work on Creed and Black Panther. And unfortunately, Hans Zimmer was not able to come back this time around because he was doing Doom Part 1 and Part 2. All of that was great, guys. All of that was great. But still, unfortunately, I can't really give you a full reaction or review because I fell asleep while I was watching this movie. Yes, I did fall asleep. Now, I am not saying that this movie is horrible, that this movie is trash or anything like that. Guys, I was just tired. And not only did I fall asleep, guys, I fell asleep twice. No during this three hour movie. I do plan on seeing it again. I'm also gonna be going live this Sunday with Kimberly, Sunday, January the 23rd at noon p.m. CST. And so I planned on seeing it again anyway, but when I do see the film again, it will be in proper IMAX format. And I will at that time be able to give you a full length review with all the pros, all the cons, if any. And from what I remember, guys, the movie was great. The performances was lovely. The score, all of that was fantastic. Really great editing, too. But I fell asleep. Not saying the movie is bad. I was just very, very tired. So sorry about that. But still wanted to come and give you some type of reaction because some of you knew that I was seeing this film. And to the studios out there, Universal, thank you so much for the opportunity of letting me see this film early. I know my review will be late, but I promise I will get it to you. Guys, I want to thank you so much. But before you go, don't forget that my name is Brandon Keith Avery. And that's just my opinion. Peace. And you can still subscribe if you want to. Help me get to 50K. I won't be falling asleep in movies anymore.